কাজ করে শুনলাম যে বাংলাদেশ থেকে নাকি নুহাস হুমায়ুনের একটা নাটক নাকি বাইরের অ্যাওয়ার্ড পেয়েছে কিন্তু বাংলাদেশে মানে আমরা কেউই জানি না আমি বাংলাদেশিরাই জানি না এরপর সাইমন নামে একজন পরিচালক আছে যথেষ্ট এডুকেটেড ওনার একটা নাটক বা চলচ্চিত্র আছে অন্যদিন নামে দি আদার ডে এটা কান চলচ্চিত্রে এবং বিভিন্ন জায়গায় পুরস্কারও পেয়েছে অথচ এটা কেউই জানে না কোনো হলেও এটা বাংলাদেশের কোনো হলেও এটা মানে ইয়ে হয়নি বিদেশে হচ্ছে প্রচার হচ্ছে মানে ভালো দু একজন আছে তারা আসলে বিদেশেই বেশি করে কারণ তাদের ইয়েগুলো বাংলাদেশে মানুষ গ্রহণ করে না ওইভাবে মূল্যায়ন করতে পারে না এই জন্য তারা বাইরে ইউরোপ বা আমেরিকাতে তারা তাদের কাজগুলো প্রদর্শন করে হ্যাঁ যদি প্রোডাকশনটা বাংলাদেশেই করে কিন্তু তাদেরকে বেশিরভাগ মানুষই চেনে না বা তাদের নাটক বা ছবি কেউ দেখেও নাই কখনো এরকম ব্যাপার আর কি Okay, so good evening once again. Thank you for joining the live class with me. So today we're going to discuss about a new drama, the title of which is The Way of the World, written by William Congreve. Me, in this lecture, Faisal Ahmed, faculty member, Department of English, World University of Bangladesh. Let's begin. So in lesson one, we're going to go through the biography of William Congreve and then in lesson two, and a short introduction to the drama, The Way of the World, which is a comedy, right? And then in lesson three, text summary, and that's all I think we can cover so many things. Probably next week, we're going to go through other things which... Uh, we can't this in this class, right? So let's begin. William Congreve, right? The writer of this drama. I mean, who is also the dramatist. We can call him or address him. Born on January 24, 1670. Bercy, near Leeds, Yorkshire, England, in the United Kingdom. And died on 19 January 1729 in... London, who was an English dramatist who shaped the English comedy of manners. Okay, comedy of manners may appear as a short note in your exam. Okay, so note it down, comedy of manners, right? It's a genre of drama. So who shaped the English comedy of manners through his brilliant comic dialogue? His satirical portrayal of the war of the sexes and his, this is not a weapon war, this is a, a relationship war, okay? Uh, between genders, which addressed her or mentioned her as sex, right? And his ironic scrutiny of the affectations of his age. So irony, comedy, dialogue, interesting dialogue, which you will find in the drama, right? which is a comedy rather than tragedy. So very first drama, we find it uh, tragedy, revenge tragedy, which is The Duchess of Malfi by John Webster. And then we went through the drama Valpuni, which we also discuss in the next class. Okay. So, as it is not finished, Balpony by Ben Jensen, which is a, a comedy, and The Way of the World is also a comedy. So, two comedy and one tragedy in this semester. Right. So, William Congreve's major plays are The Old Bachelor, stagized or performed on the stage in 1693. The Double Dealer in 1693, Love for Love 1695, and The Way of the World, which we will be going through, published, uh, written, and performed on the stage in 1700, right? Around 322 years back from now. So, in 1674, 
Congress father was granted a commission in the army to join the garrison at Yoho in Ireland. In April 1686, he entered Trinity College, Dublin, which is in Ireland, where he received his MA degree in 1696. He studied under the distinguished philosopher and mathematician St. George Ashey, who also tutored his elder schoolfellow and ultimate lifelong friend Jonathan Swift. Jonathan Swift is another very popular writer who wrote um, Gulliver's Travels, right? You, I think you heard the novel's name, title. It was probably during the yes, glorious... I, I, I the okay, okay, it's very popular novel, Gulliver's Travels, right? Written by Jonathan Swift. So everybody know the novel, I think. It was probably during the glorious revolution 1688 to 1889, that the family moved to the Congreve home at Stratton in Staffordshire. Right. So when he was 17 years old, incognita or love and duty reconciled, he quickly beca became known among men of letters, that means educated society. At some verses printed in a miscellany of the same year and became a protege of John Dryden, another famous uh, poet. In that year, Dryden published his, Dryden also a critic as well, Dryden published his translation of the satires of Juvenal and Perseus, dated 1693 in which Congreve collaborated, contributing the complimentary poem to Mr. Dryden. So Mr. Dryden was a very popular poet and literary critic. So his literary career, okay? It was in March 1693 that he achieved sudden fame with the production at the Theatre Royal, Drury Lane of The Old Bachelor. Old Bachelor is his drama. Written, he said in 1692, amused himself during convalescence, warmly heralded by Dryden, who declared that he had never read so brilliant a first play. Right. Wait a second. First play, though it needed to be given the fashionable cart of the town, it was an enormous success running for the unprecedented length of a fortnight. His next play, The Double Dealer, played in November or December at Drury Lane, but did not meet with the same applause. Love for Love, another drama or play, almost repeated the success of his first play, performed in April 1690. Five. So during that era, Elizabeth and Station era, plays were written to be performed on the stage, right? Because there are no scope of electricity, no scope of TV or social media, something like that. Okay. So only the media was what? Theaters. Okay. Which provides provided live performance of drama. So, no further dramatic work appeared until March 1700, when Congreve's masterpiece, which we, uh, we will be going through, The Way of the World, was produced with a brilliant cast at Lincoln's Inn Fields. Though it is now his only frequently revived pitch, it was a failure with the audience at the very beginning. But later on, it became popular. However, it was his most appraised work after his death. The rest of his life he passed quietly enough, being in easy circumstances thanks to his private income, the royalties on his plays, 
and is not very exacting post in the civil service. So now let, let's have an introduction to the play, The Way of the World. The Way of the World, which is a comedy of manners in five acts by William Congreve, performed and published in 1700. The play, which is considered Congreve's masterpiece ridicules the assumptions that govern the society of his time, okay? So the people in the society who lived during his era, okay, did so many mistakes and did so many absurd things. That's why he realized that he should have, I mean, he uh, should write a play that will change the society how the media the medium that he used or utilized was irony or satire okay so it is a satirical play which is a comedy right just to reform the society so playwrights always targets to reform the society by producing their drama or play in the theater or on TV or on cinema screen, right? So the plot concerns the efforts of the lovers, Milament. Okay, Milament is the heroine of the drama and Mirabel, the hero of the drama to obtain the permission of Milament's aunt who is the guardian of Milament for their marriage, okay? So this is the climax or the measure concerning plot of the play. Despite a scheme that goes awry and after several misunderstandings and other complications are cleared up, the two finally obtain her consent. Right. So many ups and downs. And then later on, happy ending. So before the play begins, a number of important events have taken place in the lives of the main characters, which Congreve reveals throughout the play. Arabella's first husband, Languish, Languish is a person's name, husband, Arabella's husband's name, has died and left her his fortune. She begins a secret affair with Edward Mirabel. Right. So Arabella is the woman who is the aunt of the heroine Mirabel, uh, sorry, Milament. So they in the affair and she gets married to a man Mirabel has selected Fainal. Because Mirabel is afraid that they will conceive a child out of wedlock. Wedlock in marriage, yeah? Congreve never explains why Mirabel just doesn't marry her himself. Mirabel and Mrs. Arabella Faino remain good friends after the affair ends. Right? So Mirabel, sorry, Edward Mirabel is the hero and Arabella is his, Edward Mirabel's first um lover okay first lover but he didn't marry her he then selected Fainal. okay so mirabel the hero of the drama begins courting mrs Fainal's cousin milamant who lives with milamant's aunt and mrs Fainal's mother lady wishford To gain Wishford's favor for his marriage to Milamant, Mirabel flatters Wishford and lavishes much attention on her. Wishford becomes convinced that he loves her and falls for him. However, after Wishford's best friend, Mrs. Marwood, reveals what Mirabel was up to, her feelings for Mirabel change from love to hate. Now she will not grant her permission for Mirabel to marry Milamond, an important problem because she controls Milamond's 6,000 pound dowry. That's a big amount of money. 
The night before the first scene of the play, the first time Mirabel has gone back to Wishford's house since she found out his plan. Wishford unceremoniously dismisses Mirabel from her Cavill Night, Cavill Night Club in front of Milamont, who doesn't stand up for him and a number of other people. And this undiscouraged, Mirabel has already begun hatching a plan to coerce Wishford into accepting the marriage, a plan that Milamont learns all about through Foible, a servant. While all this is going on, Fainal has been having an affair with his wife's and Lady Wishford's friend, Mrs. Marut. Mirabel is the only one who suspects that this is going on. Foible and Mincing have witnessed the affair, but have been sworn to secrecy by Marut. Unfolding in a single day, the play begins in the morning. Mirabel is waiting for word. That is servant, wait well, and wish for servant Foible have gotten married according to his plan. In the meanwhile, he is playing cards with his enemy, Fainal. Mirabel hints that he knows that Fainal and Marud are having an affair. Unfolding in a single day, the play begins in the morning. Mirabel is waiting for word. That his servant wait well and wish for servant Foible have gotten married according to his plan. In the meanwhile, he is playing cards with his enemy Fainal. Mirabel hints that he knows that <laughs> Fainal and Marut are having an affair. Pardon? Say again. Hello. <laughs> এখন শোনা যায় হ্যালো হ্যালো এখন শোনা যাচ্ছে ক্যান ইউ হিয়ার মি নাও হ্যালো জি স্যার এখন শোনা যাচ্ছে ওকে সো আমরা বাকি আলোচনা আগামী ক্লাসে করব এখন এ পর্যন্ত আজকে ঠিক আছে খোদা হাফেজ এন্ড টেক কেয়ার ওকে স্যার আসসালামু আলাইকুম ভালো থাকবেন ওয়া আলাইকুম আসসালাম